He does. He probably doesn't need to do it. I mean, there, there is certainly a cult of person. Well, I mean, Hun Sen is Cambodian politics. He he has been in the cabinet since um, the early 80s as a foreign minister. He's been prime minister for over 20 years now. So he, it, Cambodian politics basically uh, revolves around him. He is the center of gravity there at the moment. Um, and he is somebody who has a, a very firm idea about his, his place in history and his plans. And I mean, he told me years ago that he planned to be prime minister until 2015. So, you know, he's, he's going to be there for a long time to come. If you're talking about peace and stability, he is able to um, provide peace and stability to Cambodia. The Prime Minister is uh, more popular in the rural areas because they are doing a lot of uh, road construction, um, bridge um, building, school, um, hospital, etc. He, he is a very shrewd um, poli political operator. He, he really is good at strategizing. Um, and he's run circles around all the other politicians in Cambodia. But it has to be said, they're not very impressive. The, the, the people that he's been up against have been the kind of people that you could run circles around. threshold to be achieved. Medical problems is indicative that they can be exacerbated. Maybe for the next 10 years or 20 years, when democracy uh, in Cambodia become more mature, then maybe um, we will be able to um, rotate uh, the leadership.